Hello, my name is Amy Ecker and welcome to my channel. So today we are using the Too Faced Best Year Ever palette. So I got the eye look, the cheek look. What did I think about it? What's the what's the quality of the 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 the, the, the eyeshadows? Oh my goodness. You think I didn't have enough coffee this morning? But anyways, um, I really do like this palette, so you're going to get a chance to see how I use them, how did they blend, what did it look like, did they have a ton of fallout. Basically, all of those questions will probably be answered very shortly if you I'm stay so tuned. I'm so excited to kick off the best year of 2018. I've been looking at these colors for probably, it feels like a good 10 minutes, and I'm still not sure what eye look we're going to do. So Chocolate Soleil might be pretty pigmented for my skin. What do you think? That was like, hello sunshine. Now we're going to go use the Will You Marry Me. Little blush action going on. Hashtag blessed. Looks very pretty. Hashtag blinding. <laughs> I love it. That's so pretty. Hashtag pretty. So I'm really, really confused by what I want to do today. I mean, this palette is so pretty. I just may do a couple looks at, with it over the next few days. And y'all will just have to see me use this palette over and over again. That's just how we're going to roll. So I'm going to pick up this marshmallow. I do think I'm going to go with the pinky mauve. Maybe some love actually. And that color is just pretty. I love love actually. I'm not sure if this is going to be too dark, but we're going to pick up Deck the Malls. Cheek side over here looks a little rough. There we go. Okay, so next I think I'm going to pick up this color here called Pinecone. Actually, actually. I think I want a little bit of a sharper line today. So now we'll pick up pine cone. Oh, how pretty. Hashtag pigmentation, ladies. I'm going to pick up this color here called Sleigh Bells. It's not really adding shimmer, so let's try my finger. I used these Thrive eye pencils yesterday, and I, I did like how they hung on, so we're going to try them again today. So they're supposed to be waterproof, and again, I'm doing a green below. So now that I have the waterproof down, I'm going to go... I'm going to pull this color here called Trimmed. Look how beautiful that is. We're going to set that green eyeliner. Yeah, this palette is really pretty for the holidays. I think I can use this palette quite a bit because the colors are definitely scream either fall or winter. So I love them a lot. I am going to pick up some Christmas Dream, mix it with a little bit of Snow Day, and that's what's going to go right there. Then I'm going to pick up Christmas Dream and Snow Day, and bring it around into the green and up. I guess technically I could have used the blue today instead of the green. I really want to use this color right here. I'm just not quite sure how to pull it together, but I, that's going to be a look coming up. Just saying. Just saying. I think I'm getting sick. 
um, my voice is extremely, to me anyways, is extremely deep. So that's kind of funny. Today is our closing day. Absolutely thrilled about owning a house in Texas. I, I can't believe it. I'm also excited to put my name on the registry of owning um, a house in a new state. So that's pretty exciting. I think I'm going to try this color here called Make Me Blush. Okay, it may not... Hmm. I'm thinking I don't like Make Me Blush. <clears throat> I may try to tone it down with this Glitter Flip by Ciate. There we go. All right, that calmed it down a little bit. That's definitely more what I wanted to see. I think I am going to pick up this Infinity Waterproof in Ella. This is the brownish color. So our last house, well, the house we just sold in Georgia was on top of a mountain in the middle of nowhere, and it looked like a castle. My husband's last name is Kaser, so we called it Kaser Castle. This house is really cute. Not as big as our last house, thankfully, but it has a pool. So we are going to call it Club Kaser. I always try to make little funny names as far as our houses go. The house that I'm renting here until we bought, um, I nicknamed Kaser Cottage. We are going to be official homeowners of Club Caser in a few hours. Now, unfortunately, he is not going to be here for the closing. He is finishing packing with the movers, Caser Castle, and I am going to open the doors for Club Caser. <laughs> So yeah, we're pretty excited. Sad in some ways that our, it's official that we're no longer Georgians, but really, really thrilled about the opportunity here in Texas and um, for the next chapter of our life. So we've, only, we've been in the mountains basically 20 years together. He's been in the mountains 30-ish or more total. Now we're in the flatlands. And yeah, it's just kind of really exciting to see what is possible and open a new chapter in our life. Totally thrilled about that. So I felt the day of closing needed some false eyelashes. You know, like some celebratory eyelashes, right? Because if you're going to celebrate, you got to look extra cute. And for some reason, that eyelash doesn't want to play nice. I guess it doesn't want to be cute today. I really, really like this green. Oh my gosh, it is so freaking pretty. So I'm going to have to figure out just a look with that green alone in this palette because it's just so stinking cute. So stinking cute. Okay, so I am going to finish letting these dry since they're being a little finicky. And I'm going to go do something with this hair and I shall return. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really enjoyed using the Too Faced Best Year Ever palette. Much better than the Candy palette by far. Not as great as the Matte Peach palette, but still, so somewhere in between. I really, really, really liked all of these shadows that I used today. So I used a couple of them, used a couple, and I actually will probably do a few more looks so you guys will see this palette pick up uh, a few more times because it just has an amazing set of colors in this little book. And I just can't get over how gorgeous they're gonna be for uh, fall and winter. So very, very excited, Too Faced, you did an amazing job. I really, 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 really like this little bad boy. So, have y'all purchased this yet? What do you think about the colors? Um, when they launched the pre-look of the colors, I was totally pumped about them because I thought they were stunning for the holidays. So what's your thoughts? Put your comments below. I do wanna say thank you for joining me today. I, as always, 
I really enjoy the the YouTube viewers and the friendships I've made so I hope you guys all have a beautiful day and you have a choice so make it a great one until next time